So we got state of play going on. Oh, here we go. I think it's like 30 minutes of gameplay. Hello everyone. This is now What's up, Yoshida? Producer of Final Fantasy 16. And welcome to the state of play. Today, I'm here to talk a little bit about the story. World and listen, we've got the Far Fantasy music. That is the classic Far Fantasy crystal music. I hope you'll stay with us until the end of the show and enjoy everything we have in store for you. Let's do it. Let's go. Yeah, and you said story is going to be like story based trailer. You all know the target. She was dominant. And only the dominant. Focus, Wyvern. You are key to this mission's success. Yeah. Yes, sir. Wow. Wow, listen to the music. I said focus, Wyvern. Wyvern? Or oh, that might be code. Oh, sweet old. Because they can't just be calling him a Wyvern, like he's a dragon or something. Wow. Whoa, the Helmbreaker with fire on it. Wow. While this is the 16th mainline title in the series, there's absolutely no need to have played any of the previous games before jumping in. With a fusion of real-time action and RPG features, Final Fantasy 16 has been developed as the first... Oh, this must be, that must be the beginning of the game. Oh, wow. Using the power of we have Clive's brother. Whoa, we, we, uh, there's no way we're going to fight with that. What? That's like some Panzer Dragoon stuff, bro. There's no way we're going to be using Phoenix like that. Right, okay, this is but um, Ifrit versus, I think that was versus Garuda. Titan. The Titan Dominant. Oh, Ramu. Oh, they're going in. They're showing us the summons. Shiva, my baby. Bro, this game looks ridiculous. Look at Titan. Jesus, look at him. He looks like a bloody planet. Oh, shoot, bro. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. Oh, they're going to go in. The protagonist of our story is Clive Rosfield, and his journey takes place in the realm of Valisthea. We follow the epic tale of Clive, shield of the Grand Duchy of Rosaria, as it unfolds across three distinct periods in our hero's life his teens, twenties, and thirties. <laughs> Bloody hell. They spare no expenses. A fully playable flashback will allow you to experience the pivotal events that shaped his past and present. Or this oh this might be from the beginning. Wow, look at him. And thus does the curtain open on this newest Final Fantasy adventure. Bro, you got the towns. You got the castle where he lives. What? They got goblins and knights. Bro, I can't wait, man. And I love this world as well. Like that type of evilist world. Yeah, it's not free. Oh, okay. So he didn't just die. You know, he did enter his Phoenix dominant mode. Oh. 
Oh, he got ki I think he got killed while he was in Phoenix form. Oh, so he was trying to fight. Oh. Navigation in Final Fantasy 16 is driven via a world. Oh, wow. Okay. Locations being added and updated as players progress through the main narrative. So this is a world map. The world map can be opened. Yeah, okay. Fast travel. You fast travel from area to area. Wow. Well, they look like open. Uh, it looks like open world. But I think the areas are just massive. And it's PlayStation 5. So hub worlds in PlayStation 5 are a different level. Wow. Holy moly, dude. What is going on? The chocobos. Whoa. We got a white chocobo. So you might have like normal chocobos, white chocobos, gold chocobos, black chocobos. Oh, the graphics are ridiculous. Yeah, they've been working. You can tell they've been working hard. Because Final Fantasy 15 set um set Final Fantasy back. It really did. All the battles in the game take place in real time and are not turn based. As Clive progresses through the story. Whoa! Oh that's that's oh that's uh, Ramu. Oh you see he got um, he got a guard. That probably got to have royal guard. Whoa! Oh my gosh! Odin! Z it says Zanka, uh, Zanka Tetsu. That's Shiva, obviously. Oh my god! He's ridiculous! Whoa! Oh my gosh! What is that? That's Bahamut. Yeah, Mega Flare. Oh, holy moly. Are we looking at the most powerful Final Fantasy protagonist ever? Uh, uh, that is Bahamut. Yeah, Bahamut. Mega Flare. Whoa. <laughs> I love that. Wow, that is a hundred percent Odin. And the music. Oh Bro, that looks beautiful. Like the game just looks amazing. Level 5 Zenkatetsu. Is everything just dies. Bro, I can't wait. I can't wait. Holy moly! This must be like the summon attacks, but you don't summon because you are the summon. Oh, look at all this. Okay, we'll talk about abilities, yeah? As I level up tree. Well, you got a lot of abilities. I like it. Okay, ability tree. So it's going to start off like mid-max, but then by the time you've played the game, like towards the end, or you're just playing and playing and playing, you're going to have all the abilities. But your first playthrough, you're probably going to be able to focus into one type of build, or maybe a jack-of-all-trades, master of none. Until the end. What the hell? Look at the area. Whoa! Oh, this is that um that ring thing where it changes the game. This combination allows players to unleash. This for people that people that just uh, they don't wanna, they don't like combat like real time. 
They just want to enjoy like the game story and they want the combat. They want to feel good, but they don't want to put that mastery into it. Which I get it. I respect that. I'm not that guy though. Yeah, this is without the that's without the ring. Oh no, it's you can see it's got it on. Sorry, it's got it on. Wow, the game looks amazing. It kind of reminds me of like Far Fantasy 13. Lightning Returns. The fact that Fantasy Lightning Returns was actually a good game. But just like the UI and that kind of like desert area, it reminds me of that. Story. Okay, this difficulty. Yeah, standard. Several accessories. Oh, they're going in. They're really showing us the beginning of the game. Well, this might be a demo. Clive will meet many characters along his journey who will join him as friends and He's a cadet. Oh, this might be the beginning, yeah. No, it's not the beginning. He looks so different. Oh, it's our team member. I think her name is Jill. Oh, man. I'm feeling that. I felt that reunion. Midnight Raven. Oh, this must be a mid-boss. Because of the first trailer, we saw when she was young. And they used to live but, um, in the, the royal capital before it got destroyed. Answer to the music, man. It's proper grand. Our Republican War Panther. Ooh. Oh, look at her. And she... Oh, wow. I think, yeah, I think that's Jill. And she's using her Shifa power. Oh, wow. Look at all of this. Oh, 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 oh. oh and we cannot forget Torgal. Torgal. Wow. Wow. Torgal. A smart, strong, and fierce oh, Torgal heals. I can't believe we're going to be playing the game. We're going to have Torgal by our side the whole time. I mean, you can't use him, but he's going to be godlike, isn't it? Man, that's too much. <laughs> yeah! It's like a red 13. Get her upstairs. Well, but Nan will... Don't fret about Karen. I've taken care of her feet. All of it. She's the best healer this Wow. What am I seeing? Sid. Yeah, I like that as a Sid. I like that as a Sid. I'm feeling that as a Sid. The worthy Sid. Yeah, they're going to show us the town. Oh, what is this? Okay, okay. A blacksmith. Oh, no, sorry, sorry. That was our weapon store. This is the blacksmith. Sorry. Bro, I can't wait. After upgrading your equipment or unlocking new abilities, try accessing the Arete Stone. Wow, training. Yeah, you can tell this is definitely the work of the Bayonetta. Sorry, the Devil May Cry um, developer that is working with these guys. Oh, wow. So it's training... It's a score attack battles in there. Time attack, I think. Yeah, and you can practice combos. You can tell there's a lot. Like, they didn't make it basic at all. Like, it's Devil May Cry level mastery to the combat. And if you play, like, Devil May Cry, Bayonetta, 
Metal Gear Rising, you know, you know, you know. Like, you'll get out what you put in. So if you put in a lot of work into learning the system and combos and stuff like that, and just learning the system, you're going to get so much out of it. Yeah, he looks sick, bro. With the black and red and a sword on the back. He looks so different. When like when he was younger. Like I still can't see it. When you put like the his young self with his current self, I can't see the similarities. Oh, wow. This is what I need to see. I needed to see this. Oh, mission board. Wow. Mob hunt. So you can fight bosses. Bro, you can teleport to where the bosses are. Optional bosses. Dungeons. This is incredible. Yeah. So you can accept ranks and missions. Basically, you're an adventurer. And I think that was kind of like an adventurous guild. Like... I will tell you the law of the world. <laughs> wow, what is this? Yeah, you can see that the developers, Yoshi P, he is about the Final Fantasy life. This is Final Fantasy to me. Here for another of my lectures. And Vivian Ninetales, a scholar and strategist who will be more than happy to explain to Clive the Oh, teacher. Her name is Vivian. Oh, Jill, yeah. Her name is Jill. There are all kinds of interactions and features in the hideaway to help players get even more enjoyable with Final Fantasy 16. Bro, this game, I'm going to be on this game for years. You can see there's so much. I love it when developers care this much about their work. Like, I can't even imagine how much there is to do in this game. Like, they've packed it. They've packed the game. You can see it. Whoa. Marlboro Tentacle, yeah? Oh, no. This is story. This is story. Night of the Binding Dawn. Blinding Dawn. Fina. Whoa. Are these hunts? Or oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Midnight Raven. Oh, this must be like some organization we're fighting against. Oh wow. Oh, it's just us and Torgal. Oh no, 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 no. Sits with us. Whoa. What is going on? Yeah, they didn't hold back. He will, of course, clash with the dominance who wield. Oh, we're fighting the dominant. Icons. We're fighting the dominant. Whoa! I'm gonna have a field they learned in these battles. Whoa! Garuda. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The surrounding lands under their sway. And this must be like a hidden boss. Asteroid Dragon? Mysterious constructs of the fall. Control node. Yeah, these are optional bosses. Bro, I'm loving this must be a dungeon. The Arum Giant. Yeah, they weren't messing about. Liquid flame. What the hell? Whoa! Yeah, they're not messing about. This is a proper Final Fantasy. This must be a dungeon or something. Wow. Oh my god. Bar Barnabas. Who are you? Oh. Oh, I saw the visual cue. 
he split, he flashed, he flashed, um, there was a little bit of a flash. And we cannot forget the icons themselves. Oh my gosh! Unparalleled real time action combat as Clive takes command of the iconic might coursing through his veins and shatters his very limits. Oh wow. The shining point of Final Fantasy 16, however to be the breathtaking icon versus icon battles okay so summer versus summon i don't know what he's saying i tried to put the captions on but the captions are just gibberish i think it's because this is it's not live it can't be live but yeah the captions are not working so the battles happen in real time so it's not like pre-rendered or it's not a cutscene. It's actually you are doing the. So it looks. It does look like you're watching a cutscene. The, the graphics are unbelievable. I can't believe it. Whoa! Oh, we fight Bahamut. This is the Bahamut fight. Yeah, 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 I can see it. I can't wait for you to get your There's no loading. It's just seamless, seamless, seamless. Look at the numbers. 23K. Oh, my God. Like, it's nothing. We really just hit an 18K, 23K. Whoa. Titan makes... If it looked tiny. Uh, um, uh, 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 The Dragonborn! The music! Uh, uh, wow, that is like some Panzer Dragoon! And he turns into Phoenix in Phoenix versus Bahamut flying! Bro, stop! What am I watching? Whoa! We got a lock on! Bro, this is Panzer Dragoon. Yeah, they really want to blow our minds. They really were trying to blow our minds with this. This is why they're working so hard and they won't show something for so long. Because they're doing all of this! Typhoon! Who's Typhoon? That must be like, uh, that must be an optional boss. Whoa! Is that Ifrit running? Whoa! Whoa! Oh my god! What in the world is this? This is Ifrit versus Titan. They're not messing around, dude. They really are not messing around. Because they're trying to save Final Fantasy with this, isn't it? Like the numbered series, they really need to save Final Fantasy. Because 15 really, really damaged the reputation of Final Fantasy. I mean, for me, this is perfect. Was that 2 million? I swear I saw six, seven numbers. Final Fantasy 16 will be available worldwide on June 22nd. And there's still plenty that we've left to reveal. Battle content, side content, endgame content, and more. They've got more coming. Hope to bring you more on these aspects of the game in the near future. Also, I'm truly excited to finally be able to reveal that Final Fantasy 16's main theme 
was written and performed by one of Japan's Oh, the theme tune or like the main song for it. We've still got a lot more in store for you in the coming weeks and I hope you all pre-order the game. They've got more coming. So we can look forward to it. Yoshida, you're the man. Yeah, that was it. You're the man. Bro, that was amazing. Oh my gosh. Was that 30 minutes? That felt like five minutes. Oh my gosh. That was incredible. They really, really are trying to blow our minds, dude. Oh my word. And they did. So yeah, that was the Final Fantasy State of Play. That was amazing. Uh, I love that. That was a lot to take in. That was a lot. I need to start looking to get myself a PlayStation 5. It's not hard to get a PlayStation 5. Well, last time I checked about three, four weeks ago. No, no, it's about two or something weeks ago. PlayStation 5 looked like it was available. So I'm not stressed out about... I'm not stressed about, can I get a PlayStation 5? I know I can. It's just when I feel I need to. Because I don't feel like I need to. I don't feel like I'm missing anything. But I need that. I need that. Warriors... That was the state of play for Final Fantasy 16. That was absolutely incredible. I give that a 10 out of 10. And um, let me know what you guys think. If you, want, um, you know, are you excited for that? You've got PlayStation 5. You've got to buy the Final Fantasy 16. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. And that was surprisingly easy to understand what he was saying. You know, so I don't feel like I missed too much. In terms of, you know, because there was no English translation. Which I prefer this type of version, to be honest with you. And, yeah, the captions were not working. So, never mind. Warriors, thanks for watching. I will say take care. Um, stay blessed. And I've got my Final Fantasy, I'm sorry, my Resident Evil 4 remake review coming soon. Alright, Warriors. Later. Thank <laughs> you.